What is up guys? A long time no see. Yeah, three or four weeks. It has been quite some time since we have really done anything on YouTube, especially Supercard. I've just kind of been taking a break from Supercard the last three or four weeks, kind of been doing the basic minimum. I'm actually really surprised that I'm SummerSlam 20 because I really haven't done anything. Haven't really played any events, haven't really gotten any pros. I think I have three elemental pros and that is it but it's still good enough to get me into SummerSlam 20. I guess if you're wondering what I've been doing I mean besides for my surgery I've been on vacation as well and if you remember quite some time ago I told you about I guess the plans for the channel to do all of these games coming soon well Madden comes out tomorrow so we'll be doing that 2k comes out on the 24th and then we got Battlegrounds a few weeks after that. But uh, yeah, let's get back to this. SummerSlam 20. Y'all have to let me know what do you think of the card design? What do you think of the Jeff Hardy first event? Giants Unleashed. Not really even sure I'm going to play it. But we do have a SummerSlam 20 freebie to get. I do have a ladder reward, a male ladder reward that I'm going to pick up. And of course, the packs. Now, last tier, elemental tier, I didn't even bother posting my video because it was so bad. I didn't pull a single elemental besides for my freebie. Um, I kind of have a new setup too. I did get a new phone, finally, and I have it hooked up where I don't use blue stacks anymore. I have plugged in my phone directly to my Elgato. I've hooked up this neat little mouse. Look at that. I hooked up Bluetooth. I have a mouse that I use to move around on my phone and stuff. Now all I need is really like a stand to set my phone on so I can look at it instead of having to look down to see where the mouse is. But anyways, yeah, Jeff Hardy event, SummerSlam 20. What do y'all think of this design? I can't necessarily say that I'm all too excited for it. I mean, it looks okay. It looks kind of boring and plain to me. Even the SummerSlam 20, the SummerSlam 19s, I really like. The SummerSlam 18s, I really like. But the SummerSlam 20s, I can't say I'm the biggest fan of the Elemental tier. I really liked that design. I think what's kind of interesting with the Elemental tier anyway is that even though I don't have them proed up, I actually ended up right now, I have two male Elemental Pros and three female Elemental Pros. With me not even trying, I guess, you know, just playing the events or doing, you know, whatever it is, just minimal, my pro, my, my pulls have been pretty much all female, starting from the very beginning, from my freebie. Now, if we could do the same thing here and pick up another female for the SummerSlam 20 freebie, we'll see how it goes. I do need to get some sort of stand, though, because looking down on this, like if this is how I'm going to do like streams or something, not going to work. This setup is certainly a lot better than using blue stacks. I really did not like using blue stacks whatsoever. Hopefully, um, I can get a stand, though. Once I get a stand, it'll be a lot easier for sure. Very last pick. Don't even say that. Okay. Well, oh, there it is. All right. Maybe not the last pick. Female? Nikki Cross. Wow. So I I don't know. That's two tiers in a row. I really like Nikki Cross too. I think I seen somebody in the Discord actually pull the Nikki Cross because I made some comment about it just jokingly. But uh yeah, that is a good pull for me. I like uh Nikki Cross. Asuka is who I pulled for the elemental tier. Now, of course, being that I did not play very much the past three or four weeks, we only have enough tickets to get exactly 10 packs. Now, just about anything is better than the elemental tier. Like I said, besides for my freebie, I did not pull a single elemental card and I had, I think, 22 ticket packs and something like eight or nine of those uh, LP packs. So anything is pretty much better, and uh, I guess unless, of course, we don't get any SummerSlam 20s and hardly get any Elementals, I guess then maybe it would be worse, but hopefully we don't. Hopefully we get a SummerSlam 20, I can't remember. Do they? Do these come with training cards? Do they? I don't know. I don't know. We only get two cards, so that's a train up, that's a train up. Wow, very first pack. Very first pack, and they're going to give me a SummerSlam 20. This definitely makes up for it. Maybe they're trying to get me back into the game. Since I have not been playing 
hardly at all. Um, haven't spent any money, haven't really put in any time. They are going to start giving me some SummerSlam 20s to start, start it off right, maybe get me back into streaming, doing videos. We get Kushida. Okay. Hey, you know what? I need something because I'm barely SummerSlam 20. I need to get to that uh, SummerSlam 20 plus. Maybe if I level that up, it'll be just hopefully... Hopefully it would be better than a, than a um, WrestleMania Pro, but maybe not quite as good as an Elemental. But still, one for one, I'll take it. Now that seems more like it. Royal Rumbles, Tony Storm, King Corbin. But even if I don't pull a single SummerSlam 20 for the rest of the time, that's still better than what we were last year. Another Naomi. What is this, pack number four? Hey, SummerSlam 20 train up and another SummerSlam 20 in the back? Could this be two in two in, in a ticket pack? Two pulls in a ticket pack? Asuka? Okay. Oh man, what a troll. They gave me two SummerSlam 20 train ups. Okay, another bad pack. That's alright. Ember Moon. I'm already ahead of the game, I think. I have been seeing quite a few people though pull a lot of SummerSlam 20s. So maybe the pull rates are a little bit better. I don't know, maybe they change stuff up. Natalia. Alright. And a Tucker. I, I totally forgot about this. It's been so long since I even opened these. I remember starting, I guess, in elemental tier. It does guarantee a female, so Yeah, that's kinda cool. I, I do like that. I totally forgot about that. Two Royal Rumbles, China. Only three packs to go. Bianca, Rikishi. Hey. That is one of my elemental pros, is Lita. I do have three female elemental pros. One of them being Lita, and that's actually our first elemental pro this entire time. I didn't even realize that, uh, yeah, we haven't even pulled, been pulling any elementals. So besides for that SummerSlam 20, I would have to say that these packs have been absolutely terrible. Only one elemental in 10 packs. But, of course, we did get that SummerSlam 20, so... Hey, two! Possibly. SummerSlam 20 and an Elemental. That's a good pack right there. Tucker, I don't have that one. Uh, Shayna Baszler, I don't have that one either. Now, the interesting thing with the PvP packs is that you could actually, you know, get the new limited edition cards which is awesome i really love the design i mean this is kind of where the downfall started for me when i couldn't complete the quest doing all of the requirements except pulling the beast i don't know what was it a thumbtack or something like that i can't remember what it was but i did the entire quest and i was still way short i mean i think i was like 12 short of picking it up and yeah that was just I don't know, that just really made me mad, I don't know, yeah. Anyways, you could pick it up, only 12,500, that seems like a lot when the regular PvP packs are still just 2,000. Even though I would love to get one of those, obviously I'm not anywhere close to having 12,000, so we'll just get three of these packs and maybe, maybe pull one more. We do have a male freebie or a male ladder reward to pick up. Elemental. Now, of course, these don't have uh, the train-up cards, so when we see the SummerSlam 20, no troll on that one. Ric Flair, Mustafa, The Miz. All right, nothing too special. Another elemental, Sheamus, and a whole bunch of WrestleManias. Last pack luck. Now, we obviously already got one in the ticket pack is asking for two of them in these pack openings so much to ask when i've pulled like seven of them for other people in other videos i don't think two is too much to ask another elemental yeah that's it just one single elemental shorty g okay i think that one's a bad one Okay, I guess the only thing I can hope for is maybe pull a Kushida in this one. I mean, what are the odds? One out of a hundred or something like that. Uh, obviously, it's really slim. I mean, if it was pulling a female, then yeah, better chances of getting Nikki Cross. But uh, yeah, hey, at least we got two of them this time. 
No, wait. We got a freebie. We got one pull and we got a ladder reward. So that's two ahead of where I was last time. Oh my gosh. And we got one of the worst ones possible for the male ladder reward. Okay, so maybe my luck is not getting too much better. We did get the female, but we did get the female in the elemental tier. We got one single pull throughout the whole thing, Kushida. Not sure where that one ranks, but I know, you know, this one is probably not very good. So just seeing what's in the catalog, definitely a lot of names that I do not know, like uh, Scarlet, Timothy, Thatcher. I did say they put in Sonya. Sonya has a SummerSlam 20 card. Um, how about that upcoming match, Mandy Rose for the hair? I don't know if that's true. I mean, I didn't see any confirmation, but someone just told me about it and I don't know. That kind of scares me. Um, loser shades off their hair. That just seems crazy to me. Uh, Raymond Santos Escobar. That's another one that I do not know. And of course they have Mandy Rose. I mean, if Sonya and Mandy are going to be in SummerSlam, I guess they finally have to give Sonya a card right even though she was uh, I guess in that last special tier Which I didn't even get a chance to open but anyways guys that is going to do it y'all have to let me know What do you think of the tier? What do you think of the design? Like I said, I think it looks Okay The little van down there at the bottom. I like the beach vibe in the background all of that stuff I mean it looks all right. I don't think it, it looks anything too flashy. I don't think it looks as good as the last tier uh but i don't know maybe it'll grow on me after a little bit but let me know what were your polls how are you doing and yeah like i said tomorrow we're gonna be starting madden madden comes out tomorrow so we're gonna do a video maybe even do a stream and then 2k on the 24th and then the battlegrounds i'm really excited for battlegrounds really excited i think that game is going to be a lot of fun customizing the characters and uh yeah there is a huge roster list which looks super cool they say that you can unlock the characters by just playing the game of course along with microtransactions but you can still earn them by playing the game and so as long as we have that totally cool with me even if it takes a little bit longer but yeah that's gonna do it for the video hopefully y'all enjoy and we're gonna be putting out stuff yeah, starting now and tomorrow and the next day. I don't know quite yet how much Supercard there's going to be. We'll just have to see how this tier goes and how everything goes from then on. But anyways, y'all take it easy. Y'all have a good afternoon, evening. I am out. Peace.